Hello everyone and welcome back to Higher Mathematics. In this video we are going to solve this interesting algebra problem. We need to find our m. We have m cubed plus m square equal to 150. How can we solve this interesting equation? How can we find our roots? Take a look right here. I need to bring this minus, uh, bring this 150 on the left hand side. So let's do this. We'll have m cubed plus m square and minus 150 equal to 0. So I just bring this this constant on the left hand side. But right now I want to show you a real good approach how can we easily and fast, how can we fast solve this. Take a look right here m cubed plus m square but minus 150 I want to write in another way. I want to write it as minus 125 and minus 25 equal to equal to zero. So I just write this 150 as 125 minus 25. Why I write this? Because right now I'm going to group this element m cube and 125 and m square with this element. I just wanted to group this. Let's do this. m cube minus 125 and on the right hand side plus m square minus 25. I hope you, you, you can see right now why I group this these elements because 125 is 5 cube and 25 is 5 square. So we can easily write it as m cube minus right here plus m square and I write this with using this red pen. So right here minus 5 cube which is our 125 and 25 this is our 5 square. I hope you see right now that right here we have a difference of two cubes. We need to know the formula. I, I write this right here. And right here we have difference of two squares. I hope you, you know this formula. This is, looks like a square minus, minus b square. But at first I write difference of two cubes. So a cube minus b cube, which will be equal to a minus b. And in second parentheses a square plus b square and plus a b. So this is our first formula that we need right here and of course second formula a square minus b square equal to a plus b. This is a classic formula. I hope you know this formula a minus b. We are going to apply this formula right here. Right here this formula and right here difference of two cubes. Let's, let's apply this formula. Difference of two cubes we will have m minus 5 and the second parenthesis is m square plus 25 and plus 5m. And of course we need to apply the second formula because right here we apply this formula difference of cubes and right here the next formula we will have plus m plus 5 and m minus 5 equal to 0. I hope you understand this step. So this is difference of of two cubes and this is difference of two squares. So I see right now that m plus 5 and right here m plus 5. It's really good to factor out this m plus 5. So let's let's do this. Let's factor out this m plus 5, m minus 5, m minus 5 and in second parentheses we will have this one, this element m square plus 25 plus 5m and of course plus m and plus 5 equal to 0. So as you can see finally we factor our factor this our, our expression. So we can simplify this a little bit, simplify this expression. So 5m plus m 6m and right here 30. So our final we will have m minus 5 and we will have m square plus 6m and plus 30. So finally we factor our our equation. So this is our first parenthesis, this is our second parenthesis. We need to know that if we have a product of two parentheses, this parenthesis equal to zero or this parenthesis equal to zero. So I write this expression once more right here on the top. We will have m minus 5 and second parenthesis m square plus 6m and plus 30 equal to zero. So first parenthesis equal to zero, so m minus 5 equal to 0 and from here m equal to 5. So this is our first first root. And right here we'll have second and third root because right here we have third power so we'll have no more than 3 root m square plus 6m and plus 30 equal to 0 using our classic method a, b, c and d. So a equal to a equal to 1 
b equal to 6 and c equal to equal to 30. And of course, finding our m, m equal to minus b. We will have minus 6 plus minus square root of 36 minus 4 times 1 times 30 and all over by 2, 2 times 1. I see right now that he will have negative negative square root, so we will have negative negative answer. We will have m equal to minus 6 plus minus 36 minus 120 will have square root of minus 84 and dividing by 2. Let's simplify this a little bit, but here we have minus, so we can finally write it as a complex number root. We will have minus 6 plus minus i square root of 84 and dividing by 2. Or we can simplify this a little bit. We can write this 84 as 4 times 21. So let's do this. Equal to minus 6 plus minus i square root of 4 times square root of 21 all over all over 2 and right here square root of 4 equal to equal to 2 and it's really good because right now we are going to divide right now we will have plus minus 2 square root of 21 as and i in the end and all over 2 and right now we're going to divide by parts by these two minus 6 dividing by 2 we will have minus 3 and plus minus square root of 21 and times i this is our root. And of course I write this root right here. This is our real number root, m equal to 5. Real number root, m equal to 5. And right here I write complex root right here. So we will have m third and second. It will be equal to m equal to minus 3 plus minus plus minus square root of 21e. This is our complex root. So we hope you understand this explanation. As for me, this is a really good cube equation because a really good methods, a really good tricks. How can we solve it? First trick to write at this 150 as 125 and minus 25. And right now we are going to apply these two formulas. So I hope you understand this explanation. If you don't understand, write your write your suggestion in comment. Write your write your question in comment. Of course, we can easily check this root. We'll have 125 plus 25. It will be equal to. 120 which is which is correct so if you still have any question write a question in the comment write your answer in the comment write your suggestion in the comment it will be really interesting to read it maybe you have another method it, it will be really interesting to read it as well about your method and of course thank you so much for watching subscribing and see you in the next videos